may be a revolt brewing in the Congress over alleged irregularities by Sonia Gandhi's son-in-law, Robert Vadra, Congress MP from Gurgaon, Rao Indrajit Singh, has sought a detailed inquiry against Vadra and his alleged shady deals. The demand comes after whistleblower IS officer Ashok Kimka indicted Vadra over fake deals. Let's Robert go across. The Khimka episode has highlighted the issue of shady land transaction in the region of National Capital Territory. On this issue, I am joined by MP from Gurgaon, Rao Unterjit Singh. Sir, you have demanded the CBI inquiry. Why? I have not demanded a CBI inquiry. I have demanded an inquiry into all the transactions in Gurgaon over the last seven, eight years, wherein 21,000 acres of land in Gurgaon district alone have been changed from agriculture to other purposes. I have demanded that an inquiry should be inclusive. It should not be only to one uh, individual. It seems to me that there is an attempt to persecute one individual. There may be others who are just as uh, guilty, which an inquiry will establish. And anybody who is established as a person found to have broken the law should face the consequences. So, so you are saying that there is enough prima facie evidence which exists in, in, in terms of transaction that a state must inquire? I am saying that in Gurgaon, the perception is that out of the 21,000 acres of CLU, some land, about 1,200 acres of land, have been released after Section 4 and after Section 6 have been uh, inculcated. Before Section 9 was inculcated, this land has been released. Mm -hmm. So in what circumstances has this land been released? An inquiry should be held into it. But are you... Right, uh, that was Kartikeya, political editor, uh, speaking with uh, Rao Indrajit Singh. And uh, let me go across now to BGP spokesperson, Mr. Siddharth Nath Singh. Uh, 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 sir, clearly, you know, this is, this is almost like opening a can of worms and done by someone who is uh, from the party itself. The, a Congress MP has alleged that, uh, that there should be a detailed inquiry into the land deals uh, that, uh, that, that took place including Ovadras in, in Gurgaon district? Sure. Well, uh, you cannot take uh, the interview or the comments of Rao Barendra Singh, who is an important MP of Congress and a Congress leader, uh, very lightly. It's, uh, we had also said earlier that it's an open and shut case against uh, the land deals of Robert Wadra. But uh, now with this uh, interview, I think it is time that the and the parliament which is on that the Congress government should come up clean, and the Sonia Gandhi and Rahul Gandhi should also come up clean on the issues of Robert Wadra. So a serious inquiry, certainly an independent inquiry which should be transparent, should be conducted immediately. Right. Uh, but do you think that the Congress party can ignore these allegations that have been made by uh, Rao Indrajit Singh because? Uh, all this while, we have seen that the government has been fairly defensive about all allegations against Vadra. Do you think they will be able to employ the same strategy this time around? Well, I don't think. You know, the, the truth has very uh, funny ways also to come out. And they all are coming out, uh, which points to illegality being done under the Huda government. And uh, also the cover-ups, it's, it's also on the, you know, there be a, uh, accused or the papers have also said that there is uh, a land transaction or transfer of uh, for a uh, Rajiv Gandhi Foundation going to personal use for a uh, family, Gandhi family. There are all host of things. So all that will be uh, brought in front and uh, under an investigation. So a fair and transparent investigation is required. And certainly there's a lot to be answered by Sonia Gandhi and Rahul Gandhi on it. Right, uh, Mr. Singh, many thanks for joining us uh, with that perspective. Let me go across to Kartike. Kartike, you spoke with uh, Mr. Rao Indrajit Singh and uh, clearly, I mean, he's saying a lot in that interview. Could you quickly take us to the highlights? You see, Rao Indrajit Singh, when I spoke to him, 
uh, he was very categorical. He said that uh, let Robert Vadra be also investigated. But the most important of uh, or the takeaway of the uh, interview is it was a direct assault on the Chief Minister Bhupinder Singh Hooda. He said Bhupinder Singh Hooda is not above doubt. He said that is why I found a uh, I have founded Justice Party. He said his trans his administration is opaque, which means it's not transparent. Then he also charged uh, Bhupinder Singh Hooda for not uh, running a clean, uh, neat. Uh, administration and he said that th this is the reason why because there is doubt in the mind of public that this has to be investigated and he said that why should Robert Badra be above anyone and he said investigate each and every case and yeah he, he added a caveat saying that uh, let Robert Badra to be investigated but the fact of the matter is he's a Congress MP from Gurgaon and saying openly that Robert Badra plus other people be investigated is also a clear sign that uh, Rao Interjit Singh is, uh, is seeing his political fortune somewhere else. My sources also tell me that he plans to migrate from the Congress party. But the fact that a Congress sitting Congress MP is, is planning to do that tells us two things. One, the House is not in order. Secondly, perhaps MPs are sensing that the winds are blowing some other way.